2002 Dodge Stratus. I'm going to show you the do's and don'ts about the Dodge. Uh, a couple of good things about the Dodge is I'm going to bring you inside the interior. It's actually pretty spacious. Um, it's got this cool look to it. Um, I mean, it's not as good as a European model like a BMW or a Mercedes, but it is pretty comfortable. It's got really spacious in, uh, interior and as well as the rear. I'll show you right there. It's got cup holders in the back and cup holders in the front. Um, it is a 12 gallon gas tank which will get me about 280 miles from full to the gas light. Um, it's got an awesome sound system, believe it or not, for an American car. The system pretty it actually bumps and um, I'm very happy with it. Uh, I'm going to let you know the issues that I did have with it. Uh, typical Dodge, um, you have to worry about the transmission. And the reason why the transmission fails in the Dodges is that the transmission line, and there's a, a rubber mount that you have to tighten. And most people don't realize when uh, transmission fluid's leaking, once you have more transfer fluid inside the transmission, what happens? The transmission blows. So, you got to make sure that if your transmission is leaking, you got to make sure it's tightened. The other thing is, with these American cars, uh, the suspension. Um, let you know on the suspension, the front suspension, the motor mounts, the wheel bearings, these shocks, they tend to go around 70 to 75,000 miles. So you got to make sure you got to do that. There are feel it's an American car so it's very cheap. So uh, roughly the parts about 50 55 dollars per side. So if you were going to do them um it's not that bad. You just got to deal with the minor issues, but for the price, uh this car is actually pretty decent. I would definitely recommend it. You just got to look out for those three things that I've told you about. But besides that, Dodges, um it's all right. I mean, it's not like I said a BMW or Mercedes, but um it's a good car. If you have any questions about my car, let me know. Uh description on the bottom, and I'll get back to you guys. Take care.